Well, there's a new beast in town, and it's not Luke here. He's a pretty scary looking lad. But check this out. Keely just got this. This is his new project. He's got... He's maybe taken on more than he can chew, not quite sure yet. But he's already bought the turbo, uh, but he's already bought the turbo, right? He bought a, an RX-1 turbo kit. Everything will bolt right up to this. Yep. Right on. It did have a little bit of front end uh, damage to it. Nope. It did take an impact, rip that whole left side A-arm mechanism right off it. But there's a good thing, and we're going to show everybody what it is. The sound. Let's fire this baby up. Sounds nasty and mean, but we like it. <laughs> four cylinder, how many horsepower? What are they? About 140 or something. Yeah, something like that. 1,000 cc. 1,000 cc. All carbed, which is awesome. And your turbo kit that you bought, what do you think that's going to put out once that's all in? It depends what boost. The guy that had it was running like 300 horsepower, but he had rods and pistons and head work done. So. Yeah. And he was running about 16 pounds of boost, but I just want to keep it stock and reliable so probably run eight pounds of boost or maybe 200. Then. He just wants to beat me. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean what are you going to do with this because you know this is just a pig. Even that even this compact well, little thing here is 600 pounds. No my idea is I really all I wanted was the motor. I'm going to pull it out and put it into something else. Lighter weight. Lighter weight. Everybody's going to get to see what that is but maybe not till the spring, yeah, summer. It's a summer, or summer project. Summer project. If the timing was right for buying this. Yeah. It was crashed and uh, price was right. So. And so was the turbo kit, right? You, I mean, you, you just happen to click on the internet. Magically, stuff just shows up and you got to get it at that time, right? Yep. Pretty cool. Sounds good. More junk in the shop. <laughs> this is going to be a killer. What are you hoping uh, when it's all said and done, weight wise? See where I go. I'd like to do a tube chassis and stick it in that. But Anybody who's done uh, done uh, these mods, what can they bring these sleds in uh, into? It's somewhere between 450 and 500. I would say. Yeah. Like if, it, if I can get it to the weight of what my rev is now, and I think it's 480. Yeah. With a four stroke turbo and 200 horsepower, it'd be nice. Yeah. We'll see. Yeah. Right arm. Pretty cool. I'll get back to work. More to do.